after I did that What Are You Anyways film, things got a little bit more busy for me, right? Because it was festivaling, it was getting a lot of attention, and I started to become really busy with the filmmaking stuff. So I was writing all these to-do lists on these post-it notes and realizing when I looked at my workspace, it was just plastered with these to-do lists. Mm. And I was writing more to-do lists than I was actually clearing off the desk. And so it came to a point where I'm like, I gotta do something about this. And then it dawned on me, I'm like, I'm gonna take my revenge and animate my self-reflections on back on these post-it notes. Because these post-it notes, essentially these to-do lists, made me kind of think, you know, that I wasn't really, I was so self-absorbed in my own life that I wasn't thinking about the bigger pictures, the bigger world around me. And so I kind of went back and just would animate this sort of animation meditation of these world events back on these post-it notes that corresponded with a to-do list that happened during that day. It came out to be about 2,300 drawings on these post-it notes. And I would say to people, I really made the biggest mistake of my life and wasted nine months of my life because you know, I made this film that makes no sense. Mm -hmm. Or I made one of the greatest things I've ever made because, you know, maybe people will relate to this and it'll really take off. Right. So luckily, it got into the Tribeca Film Festival. There was a YouTube rep in the audience and he came up to me and said, we want to acquire your film. And I said, well, why would you want to do that? It's YouTube, you guys don't acquire films. And he's like, well, we're going to start something new, right? It's called The Screening Room. And we're going to launch it, and we want some of these festival award-winning films on there, and we like your film. So we throw the film up on YouTube, and like within the first weekend, there's you know 100,000 views, 500,000 views, and my inbox is flooded. My Facebook is just like you know polluted with people I don't know wanting to be my friend, and I'm like, and I was having panic attacks. I'm like, oh my god, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? So, you know, I let it ride. After six weeks, I could have taken it down. It was only a six-week license. But I had gotten so many job offers for music videos, for commercials, to do all kinds of great stuff that I'm like, no, I'm not, I can't take it down now. And now it's almost reached about 2 million views. And for a six-minute film on YouTube, I think it's pretty good.